What's up guys? Uh, Today is the first day of our week-long blunt challenge. We're doing it with the king palms, obviously. Um, they, I'm sure as probably some of you know, they came out with their with their flavored wraps and I really wanted to try them because I'm a huge fan of regular king palms. And um, we got the variety pack, which comes in with pineapple, strawberry, blueberry, and I believe peach or mango, maybe mango. There's a fusion pack in here also that combines watermelon and peach. So uh, in total, six different flavors, and we're gonna be doing all six of them this week. Today's Monday, we're starting off our first wrap, and uh, I'm honestly, I, I have no clue what flavor this is. They all come with this red, um, With a, with a red seal on it rather than black, um, which signifies that it's flavored, but it doesn't signify which flavor it is. The interesting thing about these flavored king palms is that they're not like other uh, blunt wraps or hemp wraps or any of them. Uh, the flavor is actually all in the um, corn husk tip that they put inside each um, pre-roll. And what you do is you squeeze it and there's an audible pop and I'll, I'll show you guys in just a second what that sounds like um, and all the flavor is in the tip uh, and I don't know I've never tried one before we're gonna try it we're gonna see how well it works um, and we're gonna see what flavor this is I, I guess it's gonna be a mystery each day um, but yeah let's figure out what flavor this is all right now that we got this lit you guys are you guys ready for the pop I don't know how big of a deal it is or not, but I'm gonna put it right up next to the mic and we're gonna we're gonna see if we can hear it. There it is. Okay, so it's a very audible pop. Okay, I can first off I can definitely smell um, I, I'm pretty positive it's blueberry, but um, let's see if we can taste it. That's good. <laughs> oh. And I was wrong. That is 100% peach. I was convinced it was blueberry, but now I forgot what mango tastes like. Honestly, I haven't had a mango in a really long time. And I'm not like a huge fan of mangoes either. So I don't have them very often. But like I'm almost positive that has to be blueberry. The only problem I have with it or the, the only reason why I have a hard time distinguishing that is because these these really do feel like natural flavors. They, they It's not like an artificial blueberry flavor. That's not what I'm getting at all. Very natural flavor though, not artificial at all. And compared to regular wraps, I mean, the flavor in this is like so much stronger than 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 just regular wraps like pro probably twice the amount i mean it's maybe if i like drink water hydrate the mouth a little bit final verdict blueberry All right, second day, Tuesday. Um, I don't know. I guess there's not much else to say. We're we're loading this up. Let's do a little smell. Yeah, I'm gonna go. On, I'm gonna go out on a limb, and I'm gonna say that this is. I'm gonna say that this is mango. Um, but I don't know. Let's get this. Let's get this lit. <laughs> what did I just try to say? Okay, let's go in for the pop. Now that I got a better smell, I'm thinking that this might be pineapple. This smells like pineapple. It's very similar to the blueberry one yesterday though. Hmm. The flavor is pineapple. 
The accuracy of the flavor, though, is... I don't know. I mean, the smell, I guess, is kind of there. Um, but the taste... We're making an audible. Every single time we try one of these, the next four flavors that we try, we're going to pop it before we light it, and we're going to do a dry hit. Because um, I think the smoke kind of affects the... Uh, profile of the flavor kind of like a lot you know throughout the whole wrap the flavor is very consistent so again there's not a problem there my rank from yesterday though I'm definitely gonna have to put this one above the first one um, I mean just being that the fact that it was blueberry it was a little lighter than this one pineapples kind of intense me and Victor are actually recording a video today and and he's tried all of these flavors. So I'm gonna call him and see what he thinks about the pineapple. I was doing, so I'm doing like a different flavor every day and I'm kind of like ranking them and like giving them a review essentially. And I, I think I just had the pineapple. How do you feel about pineapple? Were you, a, like you, you didn't like it? No. Nah. Interesting. Okay. I don't, I, 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 that's funny. So far, <laughs> so far I've had blueberry, I think, and pineapple. I'm pretty certain this is pineapple. And it's, it's good that on the first ones I did, uh, break the little peel. Okay, my dumbass was sitting here talking about our third flavor, um, and I wasn't recording. So, so we're smoking on this. We're, I mean, kind of like halfway done at this point. Um, it's mint. I've decided. Yeah, another tough one. I, I, even dry hit this. It's just, um, it's such an interesting mint flavor it's not like it's not like your typical like spearmint gum it's like a almost like mint leaf kind of accuracy of flavor i would say that this is the first one that's like pretty unrecognizable mint's a solid flavor i i think mint's a solid flavor it's the strength isn't crazy when you have it lit um but there's there's something there um it just it, it really the smoke flavor takes the mint flavor basically hostage um, pretty heavily. Um, I don't know if that analogy really doesn't make any sense, but I'm going with it. It's not really like a menthol or like your typical mint though, um, which I don't mind at all. I kind of prefer this. Um, Weirdly though, pineapple, I would still have to rank number one. And then this is a really close second. And uh, blueberry is still uh, in last place for now. But I need, I need something to fill the first spot because I don't really enjoy pineapple that much. So I would be very surprised if that was actually my favorite flavor out of all of these. Um, and the fusion one is gonna be really good. I, I, can, I can bet on that. Um, so I'm actually excited for that one. They all, they all kind of have the same smell before being popped. Let's get the pop action in. There it is. Thursday, fourth blunt. Whoa, this one smells really strong. That's, this is strawberry, <laughs> yes, finally. It's weird, the, the mint flavor was not artificially flavored or like gum flavored at all. You know how, you know, mint gum it tastes. The strawberry though is super similar to strawberry gum. 
Uh, or like if you've ever had like an icebreaker, like a strawberry icebreaker, that's exactly kind of what this tastes like. While the wrap is lit though, it has a weird um, flavor on my tongue. It leaves a weird flavor on my tongue, I'll be honest. It's almost like a burnt donut. I've never had a burnt donut, but if like a donut was burnt, that's almost what it would taste like. Yeah, I'll be honest, I don't know. I, I was a fan of the strawberry when <laughs> when I was dry hitting it. And then while I was, I'm smoking it, it's like, although the, although the flavor's distinct, it's not enjoyable. You know, I, I don't really like the strawberry flavor, while I'm smoking it the the two uh, flavors mixed together is just it's not really like pleasant it's um although all the other ones were kind of you know confusing like what the hell am I smoking like I, it could be this it could be that um it was a pleasant uh taste you know um this however is it I think w with where my rankings are everything stays the same and then this just takes its place like right at the bottom unfortunately um, I mean I, I didn't really have too many expectations for this but I didn't think it was gonna be bad so it's not smoke it's not like it's not unsmokable but it just doesn't it just doesn't mix well I don't think but yeah maybe one of the three that are left will um, really be like amazing and take like number one i'm hoping because <laughs> fucking pineapple's up there right now and i don't want it to be <laughs> uh i don't know i just i don't really like pineapple i mean i don't hate it but it's like what the fuck like i can't believe that's my favorite so far day number five what's going on uh starting a little late tonight um my girlfriend's actually out of town right now so i kind of have all the free time in the world to record so we're doing this at night um and i haven't i haven't popped this one yet but i'm assuming it's mango that's the only one we haven't done yet but it could be pineapple again like i could have gotten those mixed up who really knows if this is unknown then it really is going to throw a curveball in there but it should be mango okay here we go Okay, there's the pop. Oh! Whoa! <laughs> this is mint. Wow. <sighs> so I've already had mango and I just didn't know. What I think happened. Whoa! Mint's good as hell! Okay, 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 okay. The one that I thought was blueberry must have been mango, and the one that I thought was mint was blueberry. I'm an idiot, dude. What an idiot. This is like super, like, spearmint almost. Like, like, gum like a <laughs> okay I mean come on bro immediately I'm, I'm skipping straight to the rankings put this one up right on top so this is the current ranking with all of the flavors actually figured out um, <laughs> it's a little confusing I mean you know Trying to pick up flavors through smoke is a little difficult. And I think without uh, dry hitting it at the beginning, it's difficult. Accuracy of flavor, spot on. It's uh, more definitely stronger than the other flavors, 100%. Yeah, if I, if I were to get any of the flavors from the assorted pack again, 100% I'm getting mint. I mean, it's just... 
first of all, it's a safe flavor. If you've never tried these before, mint is a is a pretty safe flavor. But for that reason, I think it, it really makes this one the best. I mean, out of all of them, this is the only one that really like hit the nail on the head for me, you know, like was exactly what I was looking for. Coming into this, I thought this was gonna be mango. Turns out blueberry was mango and mint was blueberry. <laughs> Tomorrow, I, I know for sure what I'm getting. I'm getting the fusion watermelon mango uh, combination. So that has like two poppers in it, so. Uh, and then actually, the, ne the day after that, my banana creams are coming in so and I, that's the newest flavor they released so I'm gonna those are also gonna be included in this video now too so that's pretty cool but yeah tomorrow let's see where fusion ranks with some of the other flavors that we've had so far sup 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 okay we're on day number six all right and um, these are the fusion flavored watermelon mango flavor. You can see up here, there's a little, you can see the little mango and the watermelon on there. Um, mango was clearly underwhelming because I don't remember uh, tasting it. And watermelon, I haven't tried before. So, ooh, actually each of the fusion wraps have their own individual bead of flavoring in there so they have two in there so there's one of them is for the watermelon and the other one's for the mango so if we get lucky we can pop one see which one it is and maybe we can try watermelon too so let's get one pop in there let's see if i can just do one individual one hello no <laughs> pop both Ooh, I'm getting like a really strong watermelon. I bet watermelon's really good on this. I bet it's almost like refreshing. Oh, it smells so good. It, it smells like artificial watermelon and like mango. And it just, I love artificially flavored watermelon. So the smell of this is just like so good. Okay. Hopefully the taste of it is better. Let's, well, first let's dry hit it. Interesting. Wow. The mango watermelon is like actually really good. The combination is like so much better than just the mango on its own. The watermelon on its own is, I probably number two to mint watermelon or at least this watermelon mango is very tasty how many times has have i dropped my water on camera i, I was not expecting the watermelon to come through as much as it did on this but it really does um kind of hold on its own compared to the mango i love watermelon too so it's like Makes me fucking happy. I'm excited for banana cream. I mean, banana cream pie, like, bro, that's my pie. <laughs> what is up, guys? I'm so excited, bro. Today's the last day, um, the seventh King Palm that we've smoked in a row, and, um, we're doing it with their brand new flavor, banana cream. Okay, let, let's get the pop. Oh, where is it? Was that the pop? I can't tell. There we go, it was up higher. There it is, okay. It has been broken. Interesting, okay. It, I mean, it tastes exactly like artificial banana flavoring, which for some people is like, eh. Um, for me, I, I don't hate it. It's definitely not my favorite, but I actually don't mind it. Um, 
What I'm interested to see is how I like it mixed with the um, leaf burning. That's gonna be kind of an interesting one because it's a weird flavor, you know? Um, the banana is, I mean. So, the banana flavor mixed with the smoke flavor um, surprisingly work really well together. They don't mix to create a new weird flavor, but the, the smoke kind of masks the like real punch of um, that that comes with the banana flavor and so if you're not a huge fan of art artificially flavored banana then you actually might like these more this thing's nice dude I really like those, honestly. I Again, I think with, if we're doing the rankings, I think the beginning was, you know, the beginning I, I wasn't finding hits in any of those. I was like, uh, this is okay. But the last three that I have are my top three favorites. I mean, it goes mint, it goes f the fusion watermelon mango, and it goes banana cream. Uh, some of the other flavors were a little too subtle and kind of confusing to figure out even what flavor it was, which is a little disappointing, but some of them are also like home runs, amazing, amazing flavored wraps. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the King Palma Day flavor review. And if you guys have tried any of these flavors, let me know what you thought about them. If you tried all of them, obviously give me your ranks. I want to know what other people think of these flavors. I would buy some of them again. Definitely not all of them. I wouldn't purchase all of them again. Blueberry? Probably not. Yeah, I appreciate you guys watching. Um, I had a lot of fun in this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.